What happened to Irvin? So, so where are we now? In the middle of the lake, I think. Wait. And you've just plotted the oil factory and released a shitload of tricell into the atmosphere? No, into the water. Thanks. Oh, that's even worse, because that'll merge with the lost plagas. <gasps> Not if the oil covers it. Remember, we stopped, well, we caused an oil spill to stop the parasite. Wait, wrong game. Oh, dear. Last Plagas is just going to merge with the lobsters and make them even more sexually virulent. I see you giving me that lock that says you've got no idea what the fuck I'm about. Did you know this? No, it was a look saying, does that happen? I can't remember. It's, um... Did, okay, just, for anyone who doesn't know... Does that happen in the game, I mean? I'm trying no, to work no, no. out if there are giant lobsters. Okay. There is a giant crab. Well, no, we've already had the giant lobster vampire, but... Yeah. I'm just, like... Yeah, fun facts about lobsters is that lobsters are biologically immortal. Like, they don't die of old age. The longer they live... Wait, do you want to shoot those barrels? The longer that lobsters are alive for, like, they just become more sexually virile and powerful. Like, their carapaces become harder as they get older, etc, etc. Mm -hmm. And they just become more sexually potent. Lobsters are fucking weird. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you not like lobster trivia? Oh dear, it's another one of these sections, is it? Yep. I didn't even realize she was there. <laughs> Shava's entire character in a nutshell. Please tell me that that's how this game ends and she just caps one to ask her because he forgot that she was even a thing. Uh, I can't remember. Wait a second, who the fuck are you? What, like Bay Bayonetta style, you mean? <laughs> yeah. Like, well, no, Luca was cool. Shepard's actually just a non entity. Yep. I did love that, though. The one man who can surprise God. <laughs> did, I, did I tell you about the time, like, when I played Bayonetta 2 of Chris? I don't think so. Because, um. Dodge. Um, so I'm having piccolo flashbacks. I was playing a I was playing by an ass out of Chris, and um, we got like I basically just decided to give him the Cliff Notes version of the game and do all the boss fights against Lobster. And we were on the first one where he's in like his big diamond thing, and Chris like turns to me in deadpan seriously. He says, "Oh my God, Pete, I've seen this man on Britain's Got Talent." And then he proceeded to show me a video of a Polish window cleaner singing opera. And he had like, basically, he had like this robe that he took off and he was in a solid gold diamond suit underneath. And then like he levitated because they attached him to a harness system. I'm sure this wasn't Eurovision. No, it was definitely... I'm sure Russian, Russian did this one. Yeah. It was definitely Britain's Got Talent. Wow, that man was a shit shot. This is just gonna get increasingly annoying, isn't it? Yep. Open the gate, slap the barrel. Open the gate, slap the barrel. Sam, just tell me one thing. Why didn't you dodge? <laughs> yeah, still giving me piccolo flashbacks. Or do I have to break out Resident Evil Zero of their slugs? <laughs> oh dear. J just Spencer assessing, like, in the middle of Africa, Wasker. Wait, you've had Jill for how many days? Why not just give me her, buddy? Can't. No penis. <laughs> That's probably how it went. So just to recap, you want to give me Co you what the fuck's the name of the woman for Co Veronica? Which one? Surely kill the gunners first. 
the one the one with the arm virus that Wasker tries to mag its on punch and Alexia, I think. So just to recap, you want to give me Alexia's body? Yes. With the leeches? Yes. Fuck's sake, Wasker. And no, the well, leech was his backup plan. <laughs> oh dear. Please, it's, it's, I can't, like, I know that we played this, like, the other day, but, like, I can't remember the court scene one. Please tell me that Wasker kills Spencer by just shoving his wheelchair out the window. Uh, no, he just kind of punches through him. Okay, don't forget to reload and then give her more handgun ammo. I didn't think we had any. You got handgun ammo and you brought him slot. There's like a red herb down by the overside of the docks as well. Oversides? This yeah, that, that way. Like down on the opposite side of where you got off the boat, there's a red herb. Nice. Was that karma? <laughs> there's a shot him in the foot. I got a shot. A very, foot. very good shot. You got shot in the foot, you say. Hmm, that looks a bit higher to me. <laughs> I'm not going to make the joke. I can't believe they all... No, I'm not going to. This might put the age rating of the show beyond PG. Do you want to... That. Like, heal and then take the guy out behind you who's chucking fire out, is he? That's not how bullets that's, work. That's not how impact velocity works. They proved this in... Mythbusters. Well, I was going to say Black Lagoon, but yeah. I mean, t TV Chubbs is my favourite little description of Wasker, like, punching through people. It's not that his hand's sharp enough to punch people. It's just that it's just that he's so strong he could ignore the fact that bones exist. That appears to be a v What the fuck am I watching?! The zombie just kind of ignored her. Her AI is making me lose the will to live. Why do you think I want her to, I don't know, accidentally take several of Chris's bullets at the same time? Nice punch. Mm -hmm. Remember, Chris is so hench he can move boulders. I, have we got up to that bit yet? No. You'll know when it, we've gone up to that bit. Can I just sit going back to Resident Evil 1 HD for a second? Like, did they have the ultimate costumes in the original game? Um, if they did, I didn't unlock them. Oh, curb, curb, curb. Cut him. Yep, rifle. So... Yeah, there's a bunch of ultimate costumes, and one of them's really amusing. Get down the ladder, quick! Goddamn bats! I've had it with these motherfucking bats in this motherfucking country. Yeah. So one of Chris's alternate costumes is like um, some sort of casual clothes, and it's really funny because like, it, it's like casual clothes. It's like a shirt and a beanie and stuff, but his his t-shirt still has the stars logo. And it's fucking hilarious, because it just... Like, the best way I can describe this ultimate costume is it looks like Chris decided to come to work dressed as Jesse Pinkman. Oh, God. And I basically did every subsequent quest playthrough in that costume from then on, because it looked so goofy. And Jill has a fucking Lara Croft outfit. Wait, we can't stop here. This is backcountry. <laughs> You think Wasker's bad? Wait till you see those goddamn bats. I remember this episode of Top Gear. 
guy must be a terrible shot. No, no, he's convinced as well that Jeremy Clarkson's on that boat. Yeah, so wouldn't he want to be more accurate? Yeah, that was a rage face if ever I've seen one. Please tell me this is the next level's like getting on the boat. Do we actually get to play on the boat? Or is it yes. Jesus Christ, he's got Steve Buscemi nightmare face. Yep. Nightmare rise. Now that's nightmare rise. Look at all that gold. <laughs> what the fuck is it with Umbrella and like custom built red eye holes? I don't know. Makes it more menacing. You see that? Remember that. What, the task tube? Yeah. You're making yourself look bad, man. Like, Jesus Christ, that eyeball. Remember the thing that we flashed back a second ago. Oh, is this last plug of us? Yep. Just like the movie. Is he going to stop Chris's heart now and take the wind out of him so momentarily? Worse. Ah. What the fuck? Is he the giant enemy crab? No. He's a giant enemy fish. What? Are they read what Oh Octopus or eel? Uh, I'm not oh. sure. How the fuck did you grow that big back quickly? Where did you pull all that biomass from? Oh, you'll be saying that a lot in the sixth game with one of the bosses. Oh, and on who's played Chris's campaign in... No, it's Leon's campaign in six knows what I'm talking about. The can ridiculous I, boss fight. You, can you go back to Full Metal Alchemist for a second? Yeah. Do you remember Do you remember Amvi? Uh... That was a shapeshifter, yeah. wasn't it? Can I just say, I enjoyed that just because they made efforts to explain the problem of shapeshifter biomass. But didn't she turn into a giant thing? Yeah, but the thing is, Envy has, like... Envy has a shitload of biomass. It's just all compressed. Which is why, like, later on they find out, even though he looks like an old person, Envy is, like, as heavy as a hundred people. <laughs> or something... It's the same biomass as the giant dragon. It's just like been compressed into a smaller form. But the problem is that like all the cells are ultra dense because of it. Mm -hmm. So you can't really do anything with them. One up means that he's heavy as fuck, even though he's the size of an old person. Mm -hmm. On your right. Thank goodness that the parasite supplies him with giant glowing fuck me lights all over his body. Yeah. The whole problem about biomass, I had that same problem with the alien films. Just... Don't worry, I'll save you. If Perhaps going down quite fast. I'll get round to it. Oh, looks like I can't save it. That's you. You have. Yeah, you I was a little tied up, I wouldn't be able to save it. Oh, dear. The worst part is I remember this part from Legend of Zelda. We should play that some Which one? Wind Waker. There's just a bit where you have to go into a whirlpool and then fight the Kraken using a cannon. I remember this from Borderlands 2. What, Terramorphus the Invincible? Yeah. Dodge! Just remember he just had a laser on one of his tentacles. Yeah. Watch out. 
So will you be following that instruction at all, or are you just going to tank it? I'm going to tank it. I mean, that seems like a bad strategy, but sure, whatever. I really, I am actually really enjoying this boss fight, though, compared to the last one. I can't wait to play 6 and do the Ostanak. I'm not joking, right? I bought 6 just because I was sold entirely on fist fight with the Ostanak. Sorry, Sheva's getting in the way, as usual. Because I was going to use the turret on that guy's eye. Hmm. Like, I know nothing about that game other than you can fist fight that at one point, and it's got a giant mace for a fist. Oh, it just changes out with its arm weapon. No, but like, it has a mace when it fights Miller, is the point. Miller. Why is he turned into, like, a horror version of the birth of Venus? Because is it weird that that's the first thing my brain jumped to when I saw that pose? Probably because he's a virgin. That's about as close yeah. to the painting you'll get. Do I have to say it again? Did this come up before or after Borderlands? Uh, I think this came out in 2009. No, I think... This that? No, I think... Yeah, this was 2009. Borderlands 1... Borderlands 2 was like 2012, wasn't it? Something like that. I think Terramorphus might be a reference to this just because he's got the same weak points. Oh dear. This is why you never feed fish. Well, no, feed the fish. You don't. What do you mean, this is why you never feed fish? Is this why you don't have pet goldfish? Because your philosophy is not to feed them and you wonder why they die? That is my pet goldfish. <laughs> oh dear. That's why I don't. I'm not getting another fish because it's turned into this. It's Captain Booty Bar. He's come back from the grave. It's got like a slightly lower weak. Oh no, there you go. Jesus Christ, okay, this is getting annoying though. Good soundtrack though. I was about to ask, Jesus, how much does this health does this guy have? No, this one's easy. And then you killed him. No, I know it's uneasy. I imagine you can probably get like an infinite rocket launcher or something on Harger. Jesus, that's grotesque. Tell me what you're planning to do. Damn, Excella. I guess I wasn't going to good stuff. Ah. Excella. Where is this facility? Answer me. What is the Ouroboros project? You say yay! Wow, you two are just on top of everything, aren't you? The balance of the oil is changing and you're completely oblivious to it. What's changed? He looks like what the alien from about? Total Recall. Is it the Ouroboros project? Is that oh, yeah. No one can stop it. Uh, Ouroboros is about to change everything. It's gonna spread all over the globe. The globe. 
You could even say it's gonna saturate the planet. <laughs> yeah, so you're Chris. He never shuts the fuck up about you. All your answers wait in this cave, and they zoom over, and there's just a big neon sign. Radfield here. Yeah. <laughs> You see this? This is where they get the sauce for chicken nuggets from. Now what? We keep going. That's why I stick to Szechuan sauce. Fuck you. <laughs> Szechuan sauce, not even once. I was that people were charging like ten dollars a it, dip it, or something. No, no, it, it was some guy who was charging. Some guy got a hold of the Szechuan sauce early because he camped out. And then he started charging a hundred dollars a dip. <laughs> and then there was another guy who traded his fucking car for Szechuan sauce. He traded his fucking car for a vial of Szechuan sauce. No, it's still not there. Maybe upgrade the handgun a bit. Cause don't need more crit. Oh fuck, we've got no money. 